Your first real image of the, the main house is spectacular as you pass by it and then you come into the forecourt. Meticulous personal attention to detail from arrival, uh, a show around, personal show around to the rooms, entry into really, really grand rooms where we have the finest furnishing and fittings, high quality linen, uh, very high quality guest amenities and just generally everything that one would expect from an accommodation point of view. Some of the rooms that you've been into you'll see that in their sheer size they are absolutely splendid. Call it quirky if you will in that uh, they have little nooks and crannies uh, just really accommodating that which we could to create ultra luxurious rooms but in a, a themed style if I may respecting the, the antiquity of the house and then of course uh, the interiors by Nina Campbell who's done an incredible job uh, in marrying the architectural style, the antiquity uh, with an element of luxurious modernity that one would expect in a hotel like this. And then that's supported by a fine dining restaurant which certainly to date the, the comments have been absolutely stunning. A really nice bar area and then we have some great conference and banqueting facilities, civil wedding ceremony venues, great gardens. Edinburgh Park really has been a, a restoration of, of love and uh, fine attention to detail. Everything that I believe any discerning traveller, both from a leisure or corporate point of view, could look for. So for anyone who's looking for the ideal place to stay when they're coming into this part of the world, whether to uh, embark in the scenic wonders of the Cotswolds or Cheltenham uh, or anything else we have around here, the place to be.